In this video I'm going to tell you something more about the table functions. And the first thing I'm going to tell you is how to add and remove rows. Now I inserted a two column table over here with four rows. Now if I want to insert or add a new row then I simply have to go to the present group in the FS Pro ribbon and I go to this function add a row. Simply select add a row and an extra row is inserted and you can just basically keep on doing that. To remove rows simply go to remove rows in the present group again select remove row and you start removing rows. Very simple. Now another function is numbering your rows. However, numbering rows is limited to step action or stage description tables. And you can only insert step action or stage description tables by going to the information types. So you put your cursor in the block over here and you can insert a stage description table directly from the process over here. Just wait a little, all right. And you can also insert, insert a step action table directly from the procedure. You go to procedure, step action table, and there you have your step action table. Now if you want to number your stage description or step action table, simply put your cursor in the table and go to this function over here, number rows. Select number rows. As you can see, stage description table has now numbered rows. Same goes for step action table. Go to number rows. As you can see, you have numbered rows. Now, the last function I want to show you is how to remove tables. Simply put your cursor in the table that you want to remove. You go to the present group in the ribbon again, and here you have a function remove table. Select remove table, and your table is removed.